and I'm back again, this time in the car. I decided to do another vlog where I take my camera outside the house, and this time it's going to be like driving around. Uh, today I have uh, this open house for uh, an apartment that I'm interested in. I'm uh, gonna go check that out and see if I I like it and and whether or not I want to live there. So oh, yeah, I'll take my camera with me and do some filming, but but not do it while I'm driving because that's dangerous. So these people throw out a lot of stuff. And I'm pretty sure you can't recycle that grass in the blue bin. So yeah, I went and saw the apartment. And it was kind of what I expected. Uh, the rent rent is six seventy five a month. And it's a one bedroom apartment. Uh, the, the bedroom was actually a little bit bigger than I thought it would be, which is uh, uh, re nice. <clears throat> and then there's one bathroom which was uh, pr pretty small. Uh, same with the kitchen, it was really small. It's it basically only like a like closet size probably walk-in closet uh size for the kitchen uh the one they showed me uh, wasn't the one that will be available uh the the people haven't moved out in that apartment yet but the one they showed me was almost exactly the same as the one that will be available and I did come prepared with a whole bunch of questions like about utilities and uh, uh, the the lease and appliances if any came was the uh, it was just a refrigerator and uh, oven, oven stove, those were the only two appliances that came with it. So I I would like to see other places, the, the, the one I saw, it's going to be available end of July, so end of this month. I kind of want to see other apartments before then, just to compare. I guess. But yeah, yeah, it was pretty easy. It was just me and one other guy there. So not too, not bad at all. Yeah, and yeah, so right now there's uh, about one or two other errands I just want to do since I'm out in the car and I'm off from work. So I might as well do one. And that's what happens when you play with fireworks. Yeah. Yeah, all that happened a couple of days before uh, the 4th of July. Some people were 
up in the hills and and shoot they shot off some fireworks which sparked the fire and burned down a house I think one or two houses up there and then blackened all of that and I could you can actually see the fire from my house because I don't live too far from here. You can just see how close it got to some of the, those houses up there. Yeah. And so in Idaho, you can buy fireworks, like, like big fireworks that go up high into the air. You can buy them in the state, but it's illegal to shoot them off, which doesn't make any sense. If they're illegal, then why can you buy them? Yeah. Now people are calling to close that loophole, which they should have done a long time ago. So, why am I big? pet peeves is when people don't use their turn signals. Uh, especially when they're in front of you and they slow down and then they turn so it's like why are you slowing down and then <clears throat> then they turn and yeah it's, it drives me crazy because I'm always like a little warning and and when I was driving, I was uh, getting into the turn lane to turn left, and and the car uh, there was a car in front of me uh, before I turned, or or changed lanes, I should say, to get into the turning lane, and then when I got into the turning lane. Suddenly, the car in front of me changes lanes uh, to also turn, but doesn't use their turn signal. So I'm just like, use your fucking turn signal. It's there for a reason. Uh, I hate, I hate that. So that's why I always use my turn signal. Hey look, it's a new location in my bathroom. Uh, I, I just came in here to wrap up this video. And behind me you see my baby footprints and a uh, drawing I did when I was like four or five, I think. <laughs> and and now you also get to see my camera and you see why I don't take it out very much. But, hold on, gotta adjust my grip. So yeah, so when I first started, uh, uh, so, so when I first started uh, looking for a new place of my own, uh, some months ago, and I kind of, like, stalled, I guess, or didn't look as hard as I could have, and my th therapist asked me why, uh, 
uh, what was holding me back, and I couldn't come up with an answer. And he was like, yeah, there's your answer. Nothing's holding you back. So, yeah. Now I'm taking apartment hunting more seriously. Uh, especially now that I got a good paying full time job. But yeah, yeah, what I really gotta do is just look every day because I am looking more than I used to online, but I gotta do more of it. But that's what I need to do if I am serious about getting a place of my own. And maybe also let other people know that I'm lo looking for some place to live. So then they can let me know if they know anything. But yeah, those are some steps I can take. But, uh, and yeah, I'll just have to see what happens with this apartment. But... Um, but I'm over here. Yeah. So, uh, until next video, goodbye from my bathroom.